It's more of a suburb than the rest of New York. You get the open air, not a lot of buildings, not a lot of noise at night. It's a great place to just lay low and not have the hubbub of uh, Times Square and everything. I have everybody in my building from uh, Spanish and Puerto Rican to Jewish to Russian and they're all so nice and so welcoming. As soon as I moved into the building, I got hellos and you actually get to know your neighbors and their kids. The rents are low, the apartments are big. <laughs> the park's up there for Tyrone Park, which is amazing. It's this, you go all the way to Riverside and you just see the river. It's a beautiful view up there. There are the cloisters, which are, is one of the best known but best kept secrets of New York. I know people that go to the Met all the time, but they've never once been to the cloisters and it's so beautiful up there. It's a medieval castle that um, and gardens that they've taken and restored and they have all this art and just beautiful place. With the restaurant and cafe scene, there are nice little um, family-owned uh, bakeries and uh, cafes near there. There are nice restaurants that I see up there and not too pricey, not huge amounts of money that you're gonna be spending to go there. Very mixed food. Um, you got Puerto Rican, you got um, Chinese, you got Thai, you got everything you could want. You got Italian, I mean, every single kind of restaurant you could want up there, still up there. Being single in Inwood, it's not a real place to meet someone, but I never feel isolated. You're just a train ride away from everyone else that lives in Manhattan. The transportation is a big thing because you are so far up, but you have the A train, which runs express all the way down the west side, and then you got the one train going through there, and you know, it's, it's not as long. I get from up to Inwood, down to Tribeca, in about 35 minutes on the A train. It's perfect. The downsides are getting to the east side is hard to do. Usually um, it's, it's a big transfer problem on the train. But, I mean, you got everything you need on the west side. So I don't find it, I don't go over there that often. I guess if you want to be near more people, if you want to be in the center of New York, which is what people that are just moving here want. They want to be in the center, but I've been here for six years now and it felt good to get out of all that.